Hello everybody, happy after Christmas time. <laughs> Today's vlog is a what I got for Christmas vlog. Disclaimer, not here to bla brag, blag, blah. <laughs> I'm not here to brag. I like watching these videos after Christmas and that's why I'm filming it. So I know I'm spoiled on Christmas and I'm genuinely so thankful and I don't ever need any of these things, but here we are. I'm obviously going to start off with stocking stuffers, so let's do that. Okay. So I'm gonna go through this quick. I'm not explaining everything because then the video will be 1500 bajillion hours long. So I get some things that don't literally fit in my stocking. They go on the mantle or on the floor right around my stocking, but I got chocolate raspberry truffle coffee. I got a de-icer spray for my car windshield because here in Maine, my windshield is constantly frosty. I got a detangler wet hairbrush. Yep, I got all of my face face care products. My cellar water toner, witch hazel. Cotton pads for those. Cute pens, glass nail files, because I can't have nails on for school, so these are great. A wine corkscrew and a wine stopper with my initial on it. 1600 scrunchies, so I actually picked those out. These are from Kohl's and eco tools beauty blender these random fake lashes red socks bumper sticker this cute magnet calendar of me and my family dry shampoos a new vera bradley lanyard cute eyelash glue a car coaster that looks just like my dog plastic hair ties a lock de-icer for my car. I guess you just spray it on and it unfreezes your locks if they get locked. Two Neutrogena face masks, a Dairy Queen gift card, a Marshalls TJ Maxx gift card, and a Starbucks gift card. And then I actually picked these out, but my mom saved them for Christmas. I got these little earrings, this ring, these little earrings. I'm pretty sure that's everything in my stocking. I, wait, I got candy. By the way, this is my stocking. It has my name on it and it's red on the inside. LL Bean. Haha. The candy I got, which these have already gotten into, I got Haven's non pareils Haven's is a candy company in Maine that's like the bomb. Missed on the bomb. I got vanilla Tootsie Rolls, a toothbrush, I got chocolate coins. That's a tradition in our family. These lint bears, Reese's trees, a Haven's raspberry truffle, mini M&Ms, that's it. <laughs> so that's all my stocking stuffers. Now I'm gonna move on to some of the things I actually opened. So one of the first things is this sweatshirt. I saw it when we went to Disney in May and I ended up not getting it then but I asked for it for Christmas and it's really funny because we went to Disney World and Carol accidentally got me the one to Disneyland but it's fine because it's just Disney merch and I think it's really cute and vintage. Another Disney thing I got was this hat but it's like the Disney D with like the tip of the um like the top of the Disney castle going through it. It's really cute. It's just a basic Nike Disney hat. Okay I'm gonna go on to shoes because I got three pairs of shoes. First thing I got were these boots. They're just plain brown boots that are like short heeled so I can wear them when I'm looking cute but don't wanna wear like heels heels cause I don't have anything like nice but not heels. The other pair of shoes I got were Burks are just the Arizona Ma Mocha I think but I've always wanted Burks and now I finally have them. The last pair of shoes that I got are white slip-on vans. They're a little big, so we have to return them. Really cute, easy to put on. Okay, so like makeup products that I got, I got two face masks from Sephora. Uh, my brother got me the Naked Honey palette. I know Naked palettes aren't like a big thing anymore, but I collect them. I have every one up to this one now. So I have the Honey palette, and then he also got me the Bite Agave Nighttime Lip Therapy stuff. So it's like just a balm. 
I got the Roller Lash Mascara, the Anastasia Dip Brow Promade, and the Anastasia Dip Brow Gel. I also got the Mini Better Than Sess Mascara, which looks like a candy cane. I got the Brazilian Bum Bum Cream, which is just a lotion. A mini version of the Born This Way setting powder from Too Faced. And a full-size Mario Best, I don't even know how to say it. Whatever this is, full-size rose water facial spray. I also got the Clinique moisturizing lotion. I've never tried it, but I'm excited to. And the Clinique Take the Day Off cleansing balm, which I've never actually tried. Also excited to try that. That's all the makeup I got. I'm going to move on to clothes. The first thing I got is a pair of plain black fleece leggings. Um, so they're fleece on the inside, which will be perfect for skiing. I also got a pair of airy um, plain black leggings, which are, they're the feel free weightless touch high rise like leggings, black, plain black leggings. These Columbia white ski pants for skiing because I don't fit into my old pair anymore. So I have these, a new jacket for skiing this year. It's the Calvin Klein, just puffy jacket in blue, which is really pretty. I'm excited to ski now. I also got this Boston Red Sox t-shirt, which is really cute because Boston is my team. And I got this shirt from Aerie. I have it in tan already, but my mom got it for me in maroon because it's just the comfiest thing ever. Last thing I got is David Dobrik clickbait merch. It's my first one, but I've always liked this merch and always wanted it. And my brother got it for me this year. Thankful. All right, now it's just random things. My mom also got me tickets to go see Waitress. It's coming, like it's a Broadway. They're, the show is actually closing on Broadway in like a week. They're touring, um, so they're coming to Portland. So I have tickets to go see Waitress in like two weeks. I also got AirPods, which is kind of crazy. Did not expect this at all. I had asked for them, but my mom's the type of person that's like $200 on headphones? No heckin' way. So I'm really surprised she got them, but she's annoyed with me because I always play videos in the living room and she didn't want to listen to them anymore. So she was like, it's a gift to me more than you, haha. -ha. So that's why I have AirPods. This was from Santa. My mom still does Santa presents. We get like two every year just because she can't let go of our childhood. But Santa got me a toolkit that is pink for my apartment because my dad gave me his old crusty basement smelling tools he had left over at my apartment. And now I have pink ones for myself. Santa also got me a vacuum. It's a little vacuum that's meant to be for pet hair, but my mom figured it'd be good for just little messes around my apartment so I don't have to lug out my giant vacuum, which is the biggest pain in the booty hole. So now I have a baby vacuum. All right, one of the other things that my brother got me that was a big deal um, because he does not go shopping, he went to the mall and picked this out for me all on his own and paid for it with his own money, which is so cute. Um, he got me this little diamond necklace from Swarovski. It's perfect, it's so me. I just like everything that's dainty and cute and I've always said I want a plain diamond little necklace like this and he just hit it right on the nail. So spoiled by my brother, he's just the sweetest. Ladies, he's single, he's 20, he's in computer science <laughs> major and he's the sweetest human being on the planet. He's just a really fun dude and if you want to date him just let me know <laughs> I'll hit you I'll set them up all right so my grandmother got me this year got me a Alta gift card which is always needed she also got me she got me this little anklet which is so cute and then I had specifically asked for this on my list but I wanted a little I got this little cross necklace from her but it's so cute and so me and so perfect that's what I got from her she also gave me which is the cutest thing on the freaking planet she gave me this little bear ornament it was from her tree and they don't get a tree anymore because they're just it's just so much of a hassle and they don't really celebrate Christmas at home by themselves anymore um, but she gave me this little bear ornament to put on my Christmas tree at my apartment which is just so freaking cute and then one of my two big gifts from my parents this year was if you cannot guess if you didn't see my Christmas vlog already a Canon G7X Mark II 
So very excited about this, what I'm filming on right now. Um, it's really great because it came with a tripod, a camera case, two eight gigabyte SD cards, cleaning solutions and all of the fun stuff, a tripod if I didn't say that. Very spoiled, uh, this is a lot of money, so very lucky that I did get this, but it's making my videos so much better, so much easier to edit, so nice quality if you can't already see. But yeah, just extremely lucky for all those things. And then before I show my last gift for my dad, which was probably the biggest deal, I got this from my best friend Maya. She gave it to me today. It's a little pillow that has pictures of me and BB on it, and it says B Gifford on it, which is just so cute. She's over here laughing. But I'm just literally obsessed with it. It goes with my apartment super well, but I love that I have a pillow now with my dog's face on it, because she's probably gonna snuggle with it more than me. <laughs> but I'm just obsessed, and she knows me so well. Thanks, Maya. Welcome. All right, so the last big gift that I got was a total surprise. Was not expecting it at all. My dad hides little presents in the tree so we don't see them, specifically jewelry for me and my mom. But this year he gave me a gift and if you didn't, if you didn't see it in my Christmas day vlog, he got me a little, it was a little box and it said um, something like, I promise to always be there for you. Merry Christmas. So I opened it. It is this diamond ring that has three diamonds in the middle of it, which is just so pretty. So basically he gave it to me because I, if people don't know, I haven't really talked about it a whole lot. I have decided to become closer to my faith this year. So I've wanted to get a purity ring for myself to basically promise to God that I would be pure until I'm married. So I talked about getting one for myself so that it would just be a promise between me and God and that was that. But my dad gave me this as a promise ring between him and I, um, but also kind of my purity ring. So there's a verse in the Bible. I think the verse is like a cord of three strands is not quickly broken. Um, and it basically means like between your spouse, you and God. And that's why there's three little diamonds on this because for now, because I don't have a spouse, it's between my dad, me and God and my promise to him to stay pure. And so basically this will sit on my left ring finger until I find a man that will replace it and I think that was so cute. We both cried a lot. It was probably the most thoughtful thing that has ever been given to me. Very thankful for my dad. He's the sweetest person on the planet. Like truly spoils his women. Yeah, I'll show it to you guys on my finger. It needs to get resized. Um, it's too big for my left hand. So we're gonna get it resized a little bit. But yeah, basically that's everything I got for Christmas. I'm so truly blessed and thankful for everything that I do get from my friends and family. This lady got so much for Christmas and was not interested in opening any of it. That's the tea, huh? I hope you guys had a wonderful Christmas and got everything you wanted and just spent time with family because that's really what's most important, not the gifts. I just figured I'd share with you guys if you were interested, if you're not, and you think this is a bad video, then just don't freaking watch it. That's the tea. I will see you guys in the next video. A lot will be coming up now that I have a new camera. Woo! -hoo. We will see you guys later. Like, subscribe, comment, all the things that you know what to do. See you later. Bye!